I now declare the Stockton and Darlington Railway underway. Between September 2018 and March 2020, a group of artists will work with local communities to create site-specific artworks along the track bed of the original Stockton and Darlington Railway. These will be some of the first events happening along the track to celebrate the 200th anniversary in 2025 of the railway which opened on the 27th of September 1825 and ushered in the new railway age. We put in a bid to deliver activities of an artistic and creative nature. We came here today to vote for which artists we want to do the heritage line. There was five different artists came in. They were all like doing different things like acting, speaking about dancing. We're telling about transporting people. We are struck by the history of the railway and we wanted to pay homage to that. Experience something really in the moment, live, in nature. The track is a fantastic space. Working closely in collaboration with the community to create a site-specific, joyful experience to celebrate the world's first passenger railway. This project is about you, it's about your location, it's about your history, it's about your family, it's about your home. All the other lads bring gold and silver, factory lads bring it's been so lovely to be able to have a kind of transparent process where everyone is sharing their ideas together. It feels to me like this feeds into the ethos of, of what Heritage on Track is about really, which is getting lots of people from lots of different backgrounds in the room together, all of whom have a passion for this community and the history that underpins it. The Stockton and Darlington Railway was the first passenger carrying railway in the world and from here it spread right round the world. This is why it's so important that we celebrate it. This is why it's important that we, we provide a legacy for future generations. Researching George Stevenson was a pleasure because he was he's just such an interesting character. He was a, a rough diamond, if you like. To do what he did, to go all the way to the Westminster and ask for the money in a broad Northumberland accent, and they laughed him out. But he came back, regrouped, went to see Mr. Pease. And together they got you know, they got that shoe on the road, so to speak. To me, the legacy is the past that we've inherited, the knowledge of, of the railways, but also projecting for the next you know, 25, 50, 100 years, that people can look back and see what we did and, and how we work together as communities. Working with the community is important because it gives you an opportunity to meet new people, share skills and actually have a positive impact on people's lives. We want to teach young people to have a voice. This performance will celebrate the lives of people from the past and the creativity and talent of our local participants and artists. And enable the people of Darlington to produce and perform their own work and have their own legacy. Encouraging storytelling and intergenerational learning around aspects of the area's heritage. By involving yourself in this project, you are making yourself a part of the history of the railway. Exploring as we go what makes this place so unique and inspiring to the North East and the rest of the world. We hope that this activity is going to build a lot of creativity, a lot of interest in the local history. And when we do things together, when we do things with people, that's where the magic comes. You got to like meet different people and you got to see them and they were all fantastic and it was just really good. I think it was good because you got to see the artists in real life, not just the pictures. I think seeing all the artists is like good because we it's just a small town and we don't really think that we have a lot of people like that here. We also got to know like more facts and more about our town's history because like not a lot of people especially our generation would know a lot about it and would know how, wouldn't know how famous we are and I guess I kind of learned about it today. 